Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Cold Steel 4. In the last part, uh, we explored Bryonia Island. We headed off into the Soul Shrine and took part in our first rivalry. We, uh, we won, and we got three new allies in tow. Uh, we are, I don't know what we're, what's happening now, so let's find out, shall we? <clears throat> we're off. To the next day. Turning west or touring West Arabonia. Sweet. Off we go. <sighs> Wide range radar is showing no activity detected. You've successfully exited the Air Force's surveillance range. Wow, you really know your stuff. I can see you're putting your branch campus training to good use here. Oh, it's nothing really. You guys seem a little short on hands. Are you sure we can work it and we can work? This is more than enough actually. If anything, this might get start get a little too cramped. Yeah, the ship's already a bit of a tight fit for us as it is. And given our objectives, it's only going to get more become more of a crowd from here on out. What are we at? What are we doing? Last night, are we going? Are we up to search for our allies? All right. So what's next? Want to go find Toa and the other the the other former students? Yeah. We all felt their presence back at the workshop. I definitely remember sensing Toa, Princess Alphine, and Al Annalise. Alphine. I, get, I always get stuck with Alphine or Alphine. I don't know how how to how you would go about pronouncing that. Maybe if I actually played with the English dialogue, I would know, but... There were others too, but it was hard, hard to make them all out. Oh. It wasn't clear where they were, though. They all did their part in helping us find Reen again. Where ex what exactly was that? Kind of an amal amalgama uh, uh, Some um, amalgamation of images, Im images. Oh my God, of images from all over the Empire projected through the spirit veins. I think it seemed like she focused on people who had Reen had strong connections to, who'd be willing to help him. There was a similar connection made when he brought his power under control, just for a second. Since it was only a fleeting vision, it's only natural you wouldn't have time to pick out everyone's precise locations. But at least we know they're all safe now. However, I would not rather I'd rather not leave Instructor Toa or at least to find, fend for themselves. Agreed. I'm concerned about Princess Alphine as well. Well, St. Estrella's closed, and we don't know, and know how anyone in the Imperial family's doing, other than Prince Cedric. Maybe they're on. Maybe they're on lockdown because they're, of their connections to us. We sure have a lot of friends and family whose whereabouts are presently unknown. We still haven't even found Mint or Lind, or Sherazard, But we, technically, we don't technically know her. So, I've asked the general to search for them, but she hasn't come up with anything so far. Times are tough. We've got the Great Twilight and their rivalries to deal with, plus the upcoming war. We need to decide whether we want to assist the Wizen army or find another way. Not to mention whether we want to draw out the rivalries for as long as possible or get them done as fast as we can. We might not have time to hesitate. I'm tired of feeling like a pawn in someone else's game. Be that as a sacrifice for the Great Twilight or as a participant in the rivalries. Instead of resigning myself to fate or some larger flow of things and just being pushed along, I want to start get moving on my own, beginning with protecting things precious to me and with my own hands and by my own decisions. Just like how all of you worked so hard to rescue me. Reen. Elise and Toa are only, are only the star. There are other others all over the place who are experiencing troubles. Mint and the others and Heimdall are oh, there. Oh, so they know where Mint is. Not to mention friends and family and everyone else who's helped us along the way. 
Let's start by taking back the bonds that Class 7 has forged over the years and expand them even further. If we do it with... I just muted my mic by accident. I think our bonds can spread throughout the Empire, maybe even the world. Instructor Reen. <laughs> well said, old friend. No more being used as a pawn, huh? Sounds good to me. You've been carrying all this over a long time now, haven't you? I always knew you were this heart and soul of Class 7. And now you're spreading your influence out further and further. I mean, it's the least I can do, right? The world wouldn't be, wouldn't be about to end if it wasn't for me. When I fell, I fell hard. And, but now I have a chance to make amends. I reject, opera I reject operations Yormangander and Mili Mirage and what they stand for. I want to spend what little time we have left protecting the ones we love. There has to be another way. One that only Class 7 can achieve. This will be a final operation as a class. What do you say? You said that like three times already! This will definitely not be the final operation. Let's do it! So that's our decision. It might end sounded like a fool's errand, but we're sticking with it. What about you two? Will you still help us? <laughs> it's a little late to be asking that. I've known you guys for the, you are a group of optimistic saps for two years now. I wouldn't have come back if this was if that was a deal breaker for me. Besides, I still have to settle things with Toa, Jellica, and that idiot George. I'll follow you to the depths of Jihana and back, whatever you decide to do. It matters a little to me since this is only a temporary arrangement. But I don't mind lending a hand to you helpless young dreamers. I'm interested in seeing the full extent of your resolve. She's coming around, I'd, I'd say. Well, at any rate, are you two finished suiting up? Oh, new duds! Ooh, look at that! Oh, there's Duvalis. It's weird seeing her out of armor. Yeah, couldn't exactly stroll around town in my old getup. I've had these threads ready for a while now. Well, well, you got a sense, real sense of style when you're not doing the whole mysterious villain thing. Yeah, you're looking snazzy. You're quite a ta you've got a quite a tasteful outfit on you yourself. Looks professionally tailored, even. It stands the reason that you would have worn casual attire before at some point. <laughs> soldier's armor is a soldier's pride, but I do carry plain clothes around for when I need to blend in. Though, until I find the answers I seek, I'm ill worthy of donning my armor again. I see. They're all set to go out there. They're all set to go to them. Crow, Diwali, welcome to the team. And thanks for helping us out again, guys. We'll need to use a ship once more once while we fumble around searching. Hey now, think nothing of it. Though it seems security has been on the rise all throughout the Empire since yesterday. It may be limited to the western parts of Erebonia, in terms of where we'd like to land. Parm and Aaron should both be fairly safe bets. I suspect the more details we learn about the security, the more viable locations we'll discover. That doesn't leave us much, but I guess it's better than nothing. Steady does it. We can check out how things are on one area at a time. In the meantime, though, maybe we, our connections can help throw some intel our way. I'll get in touch with Arnold and see if he can reach out some of our contacts for the Reast. Then I'll touch base with some of the RF members on, over on my ends. Ones we're sure we, sh we, we're sure we can trust. We've got some guild members on the move too, both the Messick and the Berylian. We can get the gist of the situation through the various requests they send in. Would it be alright if we use the Merkawa's computers to check those out? Of course, you can use the one right, over, right, one right over there. This one, right? Let's take a look then. Oh boy, here we go. It's the side quests. I was wondering when these side quests would roll around. Wands of cash. Oh, this town is just ain't what it used to be. I don't want to say this town ain't big enough for the two of us. This town ain't what it used to be, and I've been trying to think of a way to support folks who are suffering. If you've got the time, maybe you could hear some me out. I'll be waiting at manager residences, manager's residence in Parm. I recently had a supremely good fortune to acquire some rare ingredients, but I've lost some along with my journey. I need to return to Liberal post haste, so I'm unable to search them for myself. I would be, I would sincerely be grateful for any, for any help. Meet me at the rest area of Titus Gate for more details. And then pink death. Monster hunting! Slay this horde of creatures! 
All right, Creek Bink Squad, the Creek Pink Squad. There's definitely a few points of concern here. Yeah, I get the feeling that St. Ark might have been blocked off entirely. Let's look into these. We'll have to decide if we want to take care of that wanted monster as well. Right. We're ready to head down at any time. Our group is still pre it's pretty massive, though. Should we begin maybe trim it down a bit? Perhaps maybe perhaps six, maybe seven of us at most would be a reasonable dis benchmark. <laughs> Look, don't hesitate to leave, let me know if you can require my services. By the way, it seems the workshops received some new equipment. Seriously? We got sure we gotta make sure to check it out then. Yeah, yeesh. This is starting to seem more and more like just any field study, huh? <laughs> well, special ops missions in our case. Instructor, after careful discussion, you and the others and I have assigned the duty of first watch to me. As such, I'll be serving as your chaperone once we have landed. First watch? Chaperone? I appreciate the concern, you guys. But you didn't need, don't need to worry so much. The curse's influence has subsided for now. I feel perfectly fine. I'm afraid this particular matter is not up for debate, Instructor. It will not take our eyes off you for a single moment. <laughs> well... I'm in no position to argue either way, I suppose. Alright, Altina. Just make sure you're prepared. I'll call you down once we get to the surface. Thank you, Instructor Reen. So, I guess I see how it's good. How, I see how the gist of it. One person's gonna be required, and four people are up to me, huh? That's just fine. I was gonna keep Altina in my party anyway. Um, you're gonna go in there. Uh. You're gonna go in. Uh, you're gonna go in. I should keep Musane here so I can get her caught up with everybody else. So, we're going with Muse. Though I, also, I could always use Shiny Palm Droplets too. Ooh, she's level 94. But there's also Crow Diwali too. As much as I would love to use these two, since we haven't used them much, I don't want to get these guys caught up in level. Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. God damn it. Alright, um... I'll stick with the old Class 7 for now. Quest checking and reporting. I know how this works. I know. I know how this works. Thanks. Looks like everyone else is waiting around standby. Might be a good idea to go speak with them again. Oh, the bonding events. I was wondering when these would come. These come around too. Use bonding ones. Okay, I know how this works. Bonding event for a female character marked with a heart and can indicate the special memory that can be shared with that character. As this is an element that strongly affects the relationship between characters going forward, it's highly recommend you view all events not for any character you especially like. Okay, naturally, so it's kind of like before. Alright, interesting. Hmm. Okay, time to get the show on the road. But first things first, I should go talk to Crow again. Sweet! Ooh. Ah, oh, cause summon of Alamar. Nice. Okay. All right. So I got the white shirt. I got the black shirt. I kind of like the black shirt. I want the black shirt. What else did I get? Um, Green's glasses. Underworld Noble Cap. Cape Cap? Why did I say Cap? It's Cape. Oh my god. Alright. I have lots of people. Schoolgirl Diwali. Uh, I mean, that's not too bad on her, actually. Let's go, let's go with that. Did she get any... 
know what? I could go with a backpack. Any school uniform is not and there's nothing without a backpack. Uh Nah. Let's just do it as is. No hair. Celine still's got nothing. Crow, what do you got? Siegfried outfit. Nice. Military. We're going with his normal, normal uniform. Alright. So, what do we got up here? Get this, okay. No, oh, that's right. That's this is the uh Let me out. There's the rest area. So bonding event, bonding event, bonding event. I got okay, so I can go to all three of them. Cool. Well, hold on. Bonding event there with this is a special memory with Fee. Alright, so I have four to choose from, but I'm going to only go to three. Um, I might go to Fee's because that's a special memory. I'm curious to see what those are like. And then, uh, I'll go to Diwali's and then I'll do Altima's. Let's do with that. Alright, let's get the body events done. I need to go to the dock. Or the dock. I can't speak, it's dead. God damn it. V? What's in your mind? Oh, well, you got a perfect timing, actually. I wanted to ask you something. You tag along with me for my training? You've got time, that is. Your training fee? I wonder why she's asking me to come along. She looks unusually serious. Yes! You've got it, Fee. I always have time for you. Thanks, Reen. Let's head down somewhere to land. On land. Oh? So you don't want to take care of us in the ship's training room then? Nah, I prefer, we're heading to a pretty spacious area and one where we won't be too conspicuous. Given our said current situation. This place isn't quite the sight. This place is quite the sight. Kurt wasn't kidding when he said that it looked straight out of a fairy tale. It's not really the most ideal training spot, though, is it? Nah, but it is perfect for a f perfect fallback. Against you, anyway. Against me? I'll just cut. I'll just cut to the chase. I need you to unleash your ogre for me, Reen. I want to see how long I can hold out, hold it back. I'm not so sure about this. Well. You do plan on using it, don't you? You are the sacrifice, after all. I'm not against it or anything. It's up, it's up to you if you want what to do with your power. But if you ever do lose control of it, we're the ones that have to restrain you. Emma can do that with her magic. Laura's got her six sword skills, and Lisa has her has her EXA. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? But me? All I've got is my speed. Fee. Thanks. I appreciate you going through all this trouble for me. I get why you picked this for us now. Even if I did go berserk, the risk would be minimal without any villages around. Yep. Besides, I already got the go-ahead from Rose. So, go ahead. Ogre it out. Let's make this a practice bout. I'll just focus on countering, counterattacking and evading. Alright. Okay. I'll release my ogre power when the time is right. Things get out of hand and stay as far away from me as you can. No need to go putting your life at stake on a mock battle, okay? Roger that. Now, let's get started.
Yes! Alright, I'm fighting against Reen. This will be interesting. Battle scope. Alright, that's what we've got, huh? Missed. Alright, uh... Max out my speed. Concealing wind. I'll just do this. There we go. Works for me. Yeesh. Fast, but they don't call me Silphie for nothing. Oh, so I don't have to win the fight, huh? <sighs> nice moves, Fee. Kind of disappointed in myself, though. I really lost it there. Eh, I figured it might happen. In fact, I'm glad it did. Maybe for some good, pra good hands-on practice, you know. I'm pretty positive I can hold you back now if you ever lose control around me again. Fee, thanks. I mean it. Just promise me you won't push yourself. If anything, if anything happened to you because of me, I... I won't. Trust me, I get it. Million was my friend too, Rain. Yeah, I know. It's kind of funny how far and much you've grown these past few years. You've got a bright future ahead of you, Fee. Not just as a bracer, but as a person too. Well, you can thank Sarah and the others for that. And Zephyr too, I guess. I'm finally living life the way that they trained me to, back when I was a Jager. They taught me more than just how to, how to down a squad, you know. Life lessons, the difference between right and wrong, things like that. I see. We still have some things to settle with the Jager King ourselves, though. I have the rivalry to complete, and you... Well, he's your father. Yeah, that's why I had to keep you in stronger. I can't let myself fall behind. Not to Laura, or Elisa. Or Emma, or any of them. Fee? What are you saying? What I'm saying is, in a way, you're like family to me, too. There's this feeling I get when you pat my head. It's like, like I'm finally right, right, right where I belong. I know I'm just a kid compared to all of you. Elisa, Laura, and Emma were the grown ups. And me? I just happen to be in the same class. But, you know? That was more than good enough for me. Or at least, it was. When you lost control of the Grawl, when you disappeared from us, just like that, it was like this huge hole opened up, like I was shot right through in the middle of my heart. I 
リーンが好きなんだって、uh, Oh Didn't see that coming, did you? Well, don't worry about it It's cool I'm not that much older than Release or Yuna after all, so That's not the issue I'm having here I, um <clears throat> See, I, uh How do I put this? Listen, Fee, I You don't have to say anything I wasn't expecting much anyway Huh? Don't want to make your situation any more complicated than it already is. Besides, I know who you are, how you are. I just wanted to know how things are were with how you, I just wanted you to know how things were with me. That I feel the same way as the as the others. That's why I can't let Elise and the others outdo me. That's why I have to make sure I can hold hold you back in case you ever lose control of yourself again. Fee. I said it before, but thank you for all that you've done, and for letting me know how you feel. Sorry to leave you hanging for now. I'll let you know when I'm ready to answer. Well, you know where to find me. <laughs> huh? With what? Uh oh, that. <laughs> I'll work on it. Oh, she got her feelings out in the open. After a short break, Reed and Fee made their way out of the, back out of the woods. The two of them then walked back to the ship. The warm air of Kamadere wrapped around all the while. I shared a special moment. Damn, you got a lot of bonus bonding points. Holy shit, dude. Alright. Well, that's one down. Uh, I was going to Diwali and Altina next. Uh, where are they at? They're somewhere. Aha! Remote access to the orbital network. Documents from all around the Empire. This equipment could really stand up to what the up to the, uh, the intelligence division. Well, the church spares no effort with their special operations ships. After all, I was thinking we should make use of it while we we're here. Looks like you're right, but looks like you're way ahead of me. Given our lack of personnel, collecting information is about the extent of our abilities at present. I'm hoping to be able to help, seeing as I was I was a member of the intelligence division. Not anymore. Hmm. Something wrong, Altina? Not in particular. Seeing you has just given me an idea. Could I have a moment of your time? It won't take very long. Weird. Sorry, every day that I get a request like this from Altina. Sure! What can I do for you? Well, it's fairly important to matter, actually. It has to do with a certain account you were created before. What account? What are we doing? Access Ooh, it's him here. Wait, it's a weird thing without the snow. Wait, that's my hometown, Ymir, the hot springs paradise. I haven't been back there in a while, but it looks just the same as it did when I left. I would seem this image was captured only a few days ago. It has avoided ma any major surfaces since its designation as a non intervention zone, though it's still kept under surveillance by the IDF. I can, however, confirm the safety of Baron Schwarzer and his wife. I see. That's great to hear. I do have to ask about our direct access to the intelligence division's database from here, though. Is there any way we might get caught? There's no need to worry. The encryption of technology in this ship appears to be quite advanced. As my own account was locked, I couldn't use it to log in. Luckily, I was able to reuse an old temporary account instead. The one we had, when, when, the one we had you make several years ago. I'm no expert on the subject, but I'd say the intelligence division missed out on one brilliant agent. Thanks, Altina. I'd already came to terms with you being una unable to return to home, given the security measures they've set up at the out east. Seeing how things are going over there, even a little, means the world to me. I can't thank you enough, Altina. There's no need to thank me, Instructor. After all, I wasn't able to obtain the information that you most wanted to see. Elise. She was in Heimdall during the Great Twilight. 
and her not being in the mirror does worry me. But I felt a connection with her while I was in the workshop. I'll see her again for sure. I just know it. I understand, instructor. I'll do everything in my power to help you make that happen. For you, for all of Class 7, and for her especially. Thanks, Altina. Also, but I don't also don't want you to push yourself too. Ah, it seems the document was just has just been updated. Wait, what's this one? Ymir Specialty Goods Purchase Report? The Imperial Defense Force handles that sort of thing? It's most likely a code of some sort, as is common in military cryptography. If I remember correctly, the algorithm correctly, the solution is to... Altina? Ah, allow me to decipher for this for you. It may take a bit of time, however. I'll let you know if I discover any more information about Ymir. Oh, okay. I appreciate it, Altina. Oh. Short and sweet. Sweet. You get a lot of bonding points. But then I guess, but then again, I guess you, um, that's understandable considering bonding events are like halfway through the game now. <laughs> All right, there's Duvali. <laughs> Exorbitance like this is hardly the height of temperance, especially for a ship of the church. Well, this gigantic mirror is handy for performing my form, I'll admit. It's pretty decked out, to be sure. All the better to utilize our time while we're flying around. I might as well teach your pupils a thing or two in that case. Send them to me for training. It'll be just as much of a boon for me as it is for them. Training with Diwali, huh? Even I'd have plenty to gain from that. Yes! Why don't we try it out then? Right, try it out right now then. If it's art with you, I mean. I'm sure you could use a warm up to the ri that rivalry. Besides, it might not be the bad idea to test out your lesson plan. <laughs> Very well then. Let's go down to the surface then. Our room is small as this is no place to spar. Rain and Diwali traveled to the outskirts of Parm. After finding a large enough area, they began training. All right. Yeah. That's some speed. No wonder they call you Duvall the Swift. It's not an epithet. I... Who's these words? The epithet I take lightly. I'm just getting started. Try to keep up. Otherwise, you might die here. D Duvall? -y? I told you, didn't I? You and I are we're not friends. My cooperation with you is just a means to an end. If you stop being useful, I won't hesitate to get rid of you. Rain Schwarzer, stand, <coughs> stand before you not as an ally, but as a stalwart of a, of a society. You have no need to hold back against, as you would against a friend or a student. Show me your true power. Duvali. Alright, I'm going all out. All right, do what the battle ring was able to control his ogre power. Slowly but surely, he started to adjust to Duvali's speed. It's morning moon. It's funny you can see. It's funny you can see who she is as, as apart from her clones. She's so fast. No, don't get distracted by the clones. There's still only one of her. Yeah, look for the one who's dressed differently. Keep it together, Rain. The place you need to strike is. Look for the different outfit. There! Yeah. Diwali, are you okay? A single attack won't put me out of the action. You deserve a praise for enduring that last blow, though. It seems you're not without hope after all. We'll see how if you can replicate this performance in the future, though. Thanks, Duvali. It's been a while since I was able to fight this seriously. Don't tell me you're used to training like this every day. Well, there was never any shortage of strong sparring partners at the Society. Enos, Aenea, our Lord Arnhard, even the Blade Lord himself. The Blade Lord. I've heard a lot about him. Yep. 
Tita and Agate seem to know him. He was Ouroboros as number, force number two and a survivor of Hamel. Of, of Hamel? Grammar! Oh, and according to what Randy told me, he's gonna match the great Duval that swept in battle. Ah, uh, yes, I may have told the SSS something like that. In truth, though, my skills don't begin to compare with his. And the sense of conviction... Now, the sense of carnage in every swing of the sword was not like nothing I've ever seen before. Carnage. Justice is what the power to execute is, no justice at all. He and the Steel Maiden may follow different schools, but they agree on this point. In the end, I'm no more of a mere child than has been allowed to live in their world. I was born into a minor noble family on the outskirts of the continent, but I lost everyone that I loved in a bandit attack. Lord Arnhard, uh, Arinod, I can never pronounce, I can never say her name, found me and took me in. Any kind of strength I may have achieved, I owe entirely to her. Duvali, I had no idea. Thanks, thank you for telling me all about that. Now more than ever, I know you know the path we need to take. We may not consider us friends, but we're not enemies anymore, either. At the very least, we share a common goal. So I'll do everything in my power to help you achieve it. Whatever happens, just try to remember you don't have to shoulder this burden all alone. I can say the same to you, pal! <clears throat> Coming from you, that's hard to- yeah, she, she can agree. But I have to admit, I'm not likely- I'm not likely to find my lord by himself- by myself. I'll be counting you to do your part too, sh too Schweizer. <laughs> sure, anytime. She's coming around. Very slowly, but she's coming around. Alright. Oh, wow, she's like lo super low in bonding. Alright, I think that's all the bonding events. So, uh. She's manning the shop now, huh? So you're behind the counter today. Yep, let me know if there's anything you need. Just not equipment. If you want, I could even make some snacks. That'd be great. Thanks, Yuna. But don't work too hard, okay? <laughs> Look who's talking. We need you ready for battle, instructor. Not barely standing before because you're exhausted. You got us on your side, so don't hesitate to ask for help if you need it. <laughs> Funny you say that. Altina told me off for trying to do everything on my own, too. Anyway, you have your palm party and your Arcus, right? I have an account too. Let me add you. You can play a game via, via that or vantage matches if you want. It'll take our minds off the stress of stuff. That's fine with me. Sweet! And I could go against vantage masters. Oh, uh, only the first victory against palm will raise. Or all right, so you know what? Let's do this, and then I'll try palm because. It'll raise the new Class Seven's bond. Of course, you get the first move. Of course, she's a ranger too. All right, I get. Uh, now I'm good. These are good. These are good cards to have so far. All right. this on here hey you're some cards uh oh ah die for your crime put that there put this there Move you over here. You heal up. Uh, 
You why don't you Oh shit, that's not good. <laughs> I'm dead next turn. Uh Alright, I'm gonna seal you. Not looking too good for me. Maybe I should put Bard on as my car, cause I'm. It's over. It's like super over. There's nothing I can do. Yeah, there's nothing. Well, maybe. Yep, that's it. I win. It's close though. Woo. It's close though. Uh, you know what? I'll try my. Actually, I should probably should read the instructions, huh? down there. Feels a little easier this time around. Well, I say that, and I got my ass whipped. Alright. Bonus. I think I fucked myself here. Improve my situation. She won. Oh, no, maybe not. No! I'm 
still gonna lose. It's over. I don't know how I haven't lost yet. Easier than it was in J than, uh, Azure. Eh, I guess I might play it sometime. I don't actually know what I'm supposed to do for the most part. It's like nothing in bargains at all. Got. Uh. Holy boots! I, I'm so super poor. I can't afford anything. could sell all my shit, but... Huh. All right. How are you feeling, Crow? Physically, I mean. Pretty damn spry, actually, thanks to you. I ain't just sporting twin blades this time around. I got some dual wielding pistols too. You need my baddies sliced, diced, and full of holes, I'm your man. Roger that, I'll keep you in mind. Oh cool, he has a mode change too. Sweet. The gunner mode doesn't get the same attack, defense and speed boost is saber mode, the range of your normal attack, oh, cool. Generally speaking, saber mode should be used against a single powerful opponent while gunner mode is just, it's cause, okay. Nice. So, saber mode, reduced, has increased target defense, affecting strong enemies. Nice. Oh. So you can fish too, huh? I thought they all could fish. Alright, it's about time we head down to the surface. We're finding our friends, even if we have to turn the whole empire upside, upside down to do it. You can now challenge the rear area of Bryonia Island. Interesting. Oh, he had a bonding event too? God damn it. I don't know if Crow had a bonding event. I would have gone to his. Well, I guess I only had three, so I guess it wouldn't have mattered. Alright. Uh... Let's see. I have some requests I need to do.
But uh, first, I'm gonna go back to. Oops, that's not where I wanted to go. I wanna go back to Bryonia Island. So, you'll be taking command of the ship whenever Guys is away, right? Yes, I can't promise it'll be entirely smooth sailing, but I can be ready at a moment's notice. No worries, Resign. You got this. Alright. Sweet. How you feeling, Rain? I'm, exper I'm an experienced healer. Just let me know if I can help. If I can help in any way. Thank you, but I'm all right, really. Honestly, I'm just as amazed that you can command the soldier airship. Well, I've had a time. I've had to take the controls for Father Thomas many times now. By the way, he and the commander have discussed it, and it seems they're going to take major steps to keep the gnomes and Ouroboros in check. It seems like everyone's making moves. We have a job to do as well. I want to make sure we do it right. All I can ask is that you do your best. I'll be here if you need me, ever need me. Sweet. Oh, okay. Oh, I can go to these. Oh. Oh, I can finally do this one now. <laughs> wow, 133 still. Forgot about that one. And there's also this one, too. Alright, we've got all this. Um, well, I can travel all over the place, huh? Just not yet. But I want to go back to Bryonia Island, because... Raiden, got a moment? Sure, what's the matter? You're going to disembark, aren't you? That's some good news for you. A friend of mine is part of the no horse riding club, Ma Club nines. Imagine I'm riding so you may borrow a horse from them whatever you need. <laughs> cool. It'll definitely make my life easier. Nice. Just not here, huh? I got a whole half of the island to explore. Oh shit, there's something up there now. Uh, zoom out. Okay. So, I gotta go back that way. Blonde hair, Divaldi. Alright, I'm bound to rage. Scan the giant eight. Let's get Kurt in here for my evasion. Sweet Valimar. Check it out. Missed. 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 Oh. Nice. All right, I'm gonna use some of these. Yeah. Missed. He's not even an invasion tank, and you missed. Go three. Oh, I can't even get two. Ha! Ah. 
broke your guard. Like ha oh oh oh, there we go. Yes, Level up. Rumbling smash. Nice. Mada Mada Kurekara. Um, before I go any further, let me check their Zephyr, Cannon, Skull, Beowulf, Mobius. Says I have more more uh more stuff. Let's see. gonna give um Kurt oh whoops uh well I guess it's fine for the moment What is over here? Oh. Uh. Hey. This whirlwind. Of course, it had to be an instant death on the one I need to scan. I, kinda, I had a feeling that would happen. Really? Rude. I meant to do one of those things. Now, uh, looks like what well, that's what it looks like. That's one of the cryptids that we have to fight. Yeah, I think that, I think this is one of them we have to fight in order to get the true ending of the game. So I have no idea what this thing's level is. Uh, let me look at my handy dandy guide. This thing. Uh, 
Yeah, this thing's like 20 levels higher than me. So... Uh, yeah. Uh, I will not be finding this thing yet. Nice to know that's there, though. Scan! No status? Lame. Supposed to evade that. There we go, there's the evasion. Nice. And I forgot to do the thing again. Can I fast travel back to the ship? I can. Oh, that's cool. I guess it makes sense. There's no way for me to get back to the ship. Sasa Panda. Sweet! Link level up. Alright. Making progress. Okay, right, let's try this again and not kill it. I did it way too early. those two so I can actually scan in case I get into death. Fishing blow. Scan. Miss oh, I thought you missed. Again, I keep forgetting to use the shiny palm droplets.
強敵か面白い Now I gotta climb this thing. So high up. Yeah. Or it's the、yeah. random pot up here. I don't feel anything for Brian as Guardian, but it sure is an impressive sight. Now might be a good time to take a photo. <laughs> Looking good. I'll send it to work when I get a chance. Landscape photos. Should I send it to Rex? Yes. What did he give me? Oh shit, I didn't see what I got. I mashed X too fast. What did I get? A Aurelia and a swimwear. Ugh. Trial chest. Yusus and Machias, which I do not have with me. So. Shit. Thankfully, I can teleport to it now, which makes things, getting these things a lot easier. Except for this, because this isn't a shrine. And that too. Well, that's in a different area, so I can't really get to that area now anyway. Alright, um. The village remains. Scope out the rest of this terrain. Get the map filled out. Whoa, praying mantis. Calm down there. Out of the trial chest. Reading Kurt. Yes. Probably should I heal before I came in here, but. I do not think this through. Scan. Yeah. Missed. Oh, 
She's gonna heal up. Oh, did not buffed up. Works for me. It's like focusing on the wrong person. Powerful strike. Alright, so who's taking levels up? Ooh. Earth Bell, huh? Raging Fire EX. Nice. Alright. That is done. Finish filling up the rest of this map and get that last chest that's down there. Calvary Edge. Uh, I think that's all. Yep, that's all I can do here. I got everything. Except for that one chest over there. Alright. Let's go back to the bridge. Can I rest in here? No. <sighs> cool. Of course, CP too. Alright, I think it's about time to do some requests, so I am going to save it here, when we come back we will do some, <clears throat> we'll do our little side quests, and then we'll continue on with the story. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next part. Later!